Throughout the course of the preseason, Seattle Rain FC's offense has gotten most of the attention. When you add players like Naho, Kim Little, and Sidney LaRue, one can understand why. But don't sleep on Seattle's back four. It's a unit returning most of its players from 2013, and with added depth, the group has plenty of confidence going into the new season. We've worked really hard in preseason on that side of the game. Um, you're right, I think we brought in a lot of talent on the uh, offensive side of our game, and, and we know that um, we know we need to be hard to beat, so that's been the theme of preseason. We are very confident. We've been working with um, almost the same back four as last year, just a few little changes, but all the faces are pretty much the same. We've made sure we've been working on that from day one and, and made sure that um, we try and restrict as many opportunities to the opposition as we possibly can. New faces like Kendall Fletcher and Amanda Frisby have added depth to the roster and brought a higher level of competition to training sessions. It's the best environment for me when it's a competitive environment. You don't want people turning up knowing they're playing. You need to have people on their toes and making sure that everybody's doing the right things and which is pushing each other forward and making sure training's competitive, making sure the games that they play in training are competitive so that it brings the best out of each other and I think we've done that. Always when there's de depth on a team, the, the practices are so competitive, which is just making everyone that much better every day we're in there. Um, and I think the new faces just bring a, obviously it brings something new. Like that's why we bring in new faces, gives us a little more depth and um, more style, different styles. Um, so it's, it's been really good, it has. Having high caliber holding midfielders and Keelan Winters and Jess Fishlock is an important piece in Rain FC's defensive puzzle. I think the holding mids for a back four are like lifesavers. They're basically the door before our wall, and if they're in the right positions, which both Keelan and Jess play so well, um, they, they won't be getting through to the back line, which is what we want. Defense starts by your centre forward and works its way through, and um, it's been a it's been a huge part of our training program to make sure that every player knows their role when we don't have the ball. Lauren Barnes is joined by Kate Dynas, Ellie Reed, and Steph Cox as some of the returning defensive unit. It's a group that knows they have plenty to prove after not posting a single clean sheet in all of 2013. We have, <laughs> I don't know what you want to call it, revenge or whatever for our defense in general because we want to have a clean slate. We didn't have one last year, so as a defender that's uh, hurts the heart a little bit. So we just have so much to prove, I guess, which is always on our side. Um, but last year was last year. We're trying to put it behind us. Um, it's a new team, new year. So we're really excited to get that, get out there and show people what we have now. I'm a true believer that if you're hard to beat and that's where you build your sort of foundations from, then you've got a chance of winning games because the moment you concede a goal, it means you have to score two. Um, you know, it's as simple as that, really. And uh, I think that's going to be huge for us this season. Is can we build on some of the good performances we made last year, but we didn't keep clean sheets? Um, would be a, it's probably our biggest target of the season is to try and keep as many as we possibly can.